Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To schedule an appointment in Outlook, open the calendar folder and click the new appointment button that appears in the new button group on the home tab in the ribbon. The appointment window will then open. Start by typing a description of the appointment into the subject text box. Then enter the location of the appointment into the location text box. To set a start time and end time for the appointment, click the calendar icon to the right of the start time label and select a date from the displayed calendar. Click the drop down to the right of the date and select a start time for the appointment. Repeat this same process to set the end time for the appointment. Click the appointment tab in the ribbon if needed to view the buttons that appear within the options button group on this tab. To set a reminder for the appointment, Click the drop-down that appears to the right of the reminder label to select the number of minutes prior to the appointment that you want Outlook to send a reminder to you. If you do not want a reminder, select the None choice. To specify how you want the appointment time to appear to others who want to invite you to a meeting when using the scheduling feature of Outlook, click the drop-down arrow to the right of the Show As text box and select the appropriate time designation from this list. To select a category for the appointment, click the Categorize button and choose a category from the drop-down menu. If you have a delegate for your email account to whom you have given calendar access, but you do not want them to see this appointment, click the Private button to hide it from your delegates or anyone else that can view your calendar. Also in the Tags button group are the High Importance and Low Importance buttons which you can use to assign a specific level of importance to a calendar item. Enter any notes about the appointment into the large text box at the bottom of the appointment window. To save the appointment and place it into your calendar when you are finished creating the appointment item, click the Save and Close button in the ribbon of the appointment window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.